What if one day you wake up to an EMP attack? Would you be prepared to defend yourself and your loved ones? It's a question that deserves serious consideration. An electromagnetic pulse or EMP can disrupt or damage electronic devices, leaving us without the modern conveniences we've come to rely on. Imagine no phones, no internet, no electricity. In a world so dependent on technology, how would we cope? Today, we're talking self-defense and the items that you should stock up on before an EMP attack. Before we dive into the specifics, remember to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel for more survival tips and guides. Now let's talk about the all-important matter of self-defense essentials in a post-EMP world. In such a scenario, the traditional systems of law and order may not function as we're used to, making it essential for you to have the means to protect yourself and your loved ones. We'll be presenting these essentials in a list format, starting with the first few items you should consider. First up, a good sturdy survival knife. This is a versatile tool that can be used not only for self-defense, but also for various survival tasks like preparing food, cutting ropes, and even building shelters. Next, a reliable flashlight. Yes, a flashlight. In a world without electricity, visibility becomes a precious commodity. A sturdy, long-lasting flashlight can help you navigate in the dark and can also be used as a signaling device or even a makeshift weapon. Thirdly, consider pepper spray. It's non-lethal, easy to use, and effective at close range. It can buy you some time to escape a dangerous situation or to disarm an attacker. Fourth, a multi-tool. It's not traditionally considered a self-defense item, but in a survival scenario, it can prove invaluable. It combines many tools in one compact design, such as a knife, screwdriver, can opener, and more. With it, you can improvise traps, repair equipment, or perform a myriad of other survival tasks. Lastly, for this part of the list, a sturdy rope. It might not seem like a self-defense item, but a rope can be used to create traps, secure shelters, or even restrain an attacker if necessary. Remember, these items are not meant to promote violence, but to encourage preparedness. In a post-EMP world, being prepared can mean the difference between survival and catastrophe. These are just a few examples of the self-defense items you should have in your arsenal. Let's continue with more. Self-defense isn't just about weapons, it's about being prepared and resourceful. Now that we've covered the essentials, let's delve into some unconventional yet highly effective self-defense items that you should consider stocking up on. First up, flashlights. A flashlight isn't just for illuminating dark corners, it's a versatile tool in your self-defense arsenal. A high-intensity beam can temporarily blind an attacker, providing you with crucial seconds to escape or retaliate. Moreover, tactical flashlights often come with serrated or beveled edges designed for striking, making them a formidable non-lethal weapon. Next, let's talk about whistles. A whistle might seem like an unlikely self-defense tool, but its simplicity is what makes it so effective. In a crisis situation, a loud whistle can serve as a distress signal, alerting others to your location and potentially scaring off attackers. It's lightweight, easy to carry, and doesn't require any specific skill to use. Now on to personal alarms. These compact devices emit a loud siren when activated, drawing attention and potentially deterring attackers. Some models even incorporate strobe lights for added visibility. Remember, an attacker's worst enemy is attention. Then we have pepper spray. It's a classic self-defense item for a reason. A burst of pepper spray can incapacitate an attacker, giving you a chance to flee. It's compact, easy to use, and doesn't require close contact to be effective. Lastly, let's not forget about the power of knowledge. Knowing basic self-defense techniques can be invaluable in a crisis situation. Even if you're unarmed, understanding how to use your body effectively can tip the scales in your favor. Take the time to learn a few moves, or better yet, enroll in a self-defense class. Remember the best defense is a good offense. Understanding how to use these items effectively can make all the difference when it counts. Having a variety of self-defense tools at your disposal isn't about living in fear. It's about being prepared for any situation and taking control of your own safety. In the face of danger, these items can offer more than just protection. They can offer peace of mind. Remember, the best defense is a good offense. Knowing how to use these items in a crisis can make all the difference. As we wrap up our list of must-have self-defense items, let's review what we've covered so far. We've looked at a range of self-defense essentials that can help you protect yourself and your loved ones in the event of an electromagnetic pulse or EMP attack. We started with basic items like sturdy gloves and protective eyewear. 
which are invaluable for protecting your hands and eyes from debris and potential threats. We also delved into the importance of having a reliable flashlight and spare batteries on hand to help you navigate in the dark. We then moved on to the more advanced self-defense items such as pepper spray, which can immobilize an attacker from a safe distance, and a tactical knife, which can serve multiple purposes from self-defense to everyday tasks. Next, we discussed the significance of owning a firearm, not only as a last line of defense, but also as a hunting tool. We also emphasized the value of proper training in handling these weapons to ensure safety. Finally, we explored unconventional items like a whistle for signaling distress and a survival manual to provide guidance when technology fails. Remember, these items aren't just objects, they're tools that can help you survive and thrive in a post-EMP world. They're your best bet for maintaining control in a situation where control is the last thing you have. These items could be your lifeline in a world turned upside down by an EMP attack. With the right self-defense items, you can be prepared for anything, even an EMP attack. It's easy to feel overwhelmed, but taking action is the first step towards preparedness. Begin by stocking up on the essentials we've discussed today. But don't stop there. Continue to educate yourself on survival strategies and keep refining your plans. Small, consistent steps can make all the difference when it comes to your safety and that of your loved ones. If you found this video helpful, do us a favor and hit that like button. It helps us reach more people and share this crucial information. And if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe to our channel. We're constantly updating our content with more survival tips, guides, and discussions. Remember, the time to prepare is now. Stay safe, stay prepared, and thanks for watching.